Well, good morning. And what a beautiful morning this is after the rainstorm last night. Everything is so fresh. Wonderful day yesterday with the goose. And uh, they said it was going to be raining all day today. But uh, looking at this, as you can see, other than a few clouds in the sky, I've heard the peregrine falcons already calling. You can hear the stone chats. You can hear the thrushes. The blackbirds all calling. So, there's my hide. I'm going to... So, I decided, as it's such a beautiful day, I'm going to do a little bit of work later on. And I'm going to make the most of the sunshine for a little while and enjoy a little bit of time in my hide. Always beautiful here. Everything's so fresh this morning. Right, and this is my hide from the front. That's all that's seen, obviously. And this is the entrance. It's a little bit difficult, but you can crawl in here. As you can see, and once you're in, it's just a process of zipping up, which is pretty easy. And once you're zipped up, that's it. So, now I'm going to spend a bit of time in here, and obviously I'll get back later when anything comes along. Okay, well been pretty quiet this morning. Um, so far a couple of cars have decided to turn up and instead of parking up the hill they've parked pretty close to the side. Um, it's a shame when they turned up there was a woodpecker just arriving at the pond and they frightened him off. So I've got to wait for a while now. Hopefully it's about half an hour ago that they turned up and it's been dead quiet since then. So maybe we'll see what happens. Hopefully, uh, once it settles down a little bit, some more will come back. Either way, with this beautiful day, it's it's always beautiful here. So, even the but mind you, even the finches have been quiet today. So, we'll wait and see. Well, as it's so quiet today, um, I've come out of the. Let's see if I can get out of the wind. I've come out of the. Um, come out of the tent on my hide. Now, trying to find a place out of the wind, so I can actually do a bit of a video. Uh, I've been out looking for the, uh, for the uh, eagles and the, also some beautiful, uh, what do you call them, uh, vultures that flew over. So 18 vultures and two black ones, so I just went on a quick chase to see if I could actually find them. I've actually managed to get some beautiful pictures of the black vultures. Let me just quickly show you uh, if I can find the pictures in a second. I'm going to try and get out the wind here. It's so much wind here today. But, there we go. There's one of the black vultures. if I've got something else here. The other one was much better. Here we go. Let me come out a little bit. Beautiful. And again here, this is my favourite one. This one's beautiful. Lovely one. You can actually see his eyes on this one. Stunning bird. Lovely picture it worked out at. So, I was rather pleased I managed to catch up with both of them. The actual pond itself wasn't that good because I only had a few. I had a nice booty, uh, booty come out there, but nothing much. A few little birds on the pond, but nothing special. Always the same ones. But as I said, with the eagles flying over, it was a great surprise with the eagles, with the, um, with the vultures. I love the black vultures. 
such a beautiful, majestic bird. Anyway, I managed to get them, so that was a good one for the day. That's it for today. Let's say hello now, Eric. Look, say hello. <laughs> um, in the car, as you can probably see behind me, there's a rainbow. The rain has started, so I'm going to close up the window now, actually. But that's it for today, I'm afraid. It's been an absolutely beautiful day, but now the rain's started. There's absolutely no point in staying around. So uh, I'm going to call it a day. Had some beautiful vultures, um, the black ones, which was a beautiful surprise. And that's been about the best thing today, other than always a beautiful day in nature. Bye.